probably easiest if I take some video measurements. Probably a little, little, little bit easier. So as best I can measure it. Three and fifteen one twenty eight. Seventeen, I think that says. Okay, the depth of this back shoulder. Twenty three thirty seconds. From there to there, that's a little bit further. This this back point here is a little bit further forward than where that is there, but I can't measure across. The shaft length is two inches, but I've probably got to take somewhere around about 12 to 15 mil off the shaft, which is probably half inch to nine sixteenths. I'll probably have to take off the shaft length in order so that the pinion can move further back. Let's see what else one I need a measurement of. The keyway is 31,128 or just over 6 mil. And the shaft is an inch and an eighth it's supposed to be. Any other one I need to measure is probably from the shaft back to the bearing, from there back to there, which is where the other is, and that's 27,128. So it's that much forward of that guy. Let me just zero that off. And then I should be able to work out what that is. 65 128s. Would have hurt to know how long this guy as well. Engine 1564 to the back by the looks of it. The very back, so to where the curve starts, inch and 11 64ths. Okay, on this one here, this lip here goes over, oh, it goes over there. So, this face here is the face that's going to touch there. Um, actually, I didn't take any measurements from there, did I? So if I measure the outside, 61, 128s. I should be able to hopefully work out those other dimensions from that. Okay, it's going to be a little difficult. I haven't got three hands. measure from his face down to the bolt that's sitting on top and just measure another one Figure I've got a slot, I've got a chamfer on the inside edge here, got a chamfer there, so three and sixty 
pretty close to the buddy three and a half inches. Trying to sit on the edge of the bolt, that's why it's so difficult to get exactly right. And I've got a slight angle there. So yes, it's pretty close to three and a half inches from this front face to the bolt heads. Now from the bolt head to the front of the flange, what have I got? Try around on my hole on the phone. Inch and twenty one thirty second. Sorry about that. Probably making you dizzy. Okay, so that's to the front face. So that should give you a rough idea, since you'll know the dimensions, how far back it can go. Let's measure another one. Okay, all the rest of the dimensions I'm thinking you probably should be able to work out based on those couple of measurements. 